Hi everyone, today I want to talk about lookup array. So uh, as usual, as before that we have typed uh, all the information right here and I will explain to you now uh, what I've typed and how to use the lookup array. The array is actually referred to this string of a uh, set of values which means that now you see that you have a lookup value right here it's b3 right so it is actually the marks okay the marks of chain and then you also have the lookup vector which is the set of value right here so is this uh, 0 50 60 70 80 90 so on and you also have a result vector which is the grade which is shown according to this table so what this function tells you is that if the values in B3 is greater or equal to uh, the values stated in the local vector, then you return the grade here. So, so if you have a grade that is 90 marks, so it is greater or equal to 90 in the local vector right here, so it will return the value A to you. So let's have a look. And it's A. So when you drag it down across the column, because this is not uh, because a array is actually not the relative path, it is actually an s an absolute path, so it will not change if you drag it across the uh, across or down the column. So same if you have a uh, eighty five, so it is greater or equal to eighty, so the grade return will be B. And if you see right here, Alice had twenty five point five two marks, so it is greater than or equal to zero because twenty five point five two is in between zero and fifty, so it will return the value F to you. So the bill right here, you can see that he he got seventy eight marks, so it's between seventy and eighty, so it is greater or equal to seventy, so it returns the value C to you. I hope it helps and remember to like or subscribe our YouTube channel if you find it useful. And here again, thanks for watching.